Shout out to Juan. This is Apostle Rakar. Uh, back once again with another little impromptu. I'm going to start off first by saying, Barakatai Yahweh, Barakatai Yahweh Shai. Barakatai Yahweh, Barakatai Yahweh, Barakatai Yahweh, Barakatai Yahweh Shai. Okay? So I'm trying to get everything set up right. You know? I'm trying to get my camera set up right. Like I said, I'm going to say all praises to Yahweh Bashi Yahweh Shai. This is just a quick little impromptu. Okay, I'm about to head out for the day. So I just want to throw a little quick video up there. All right, I'm going to say shalom to all you brothers out there, little woman, uh, whoever might be online. But anyways, man, I'm going to entitle this video, The Lord is here now to set things right. The Lord is here now. You know how we keep talking about uh, the, the Most High is coming back, the Most High is coming back. Yahweh Shai is coming back, but pretty much Yahweh Shai is already back, man. Okay, the four uh, angels that's holding back those winds of destruction, those winds of destruction are already being, being released because judgment is in the earth, man. You see what happened, man, that, that, that uh, they had a little tropical storm hurricane that hit the Gulf. So the, the winds of destruction are being unleashed and people are getting jacked up and messed up out here, man. Uh, the Lord is out here doing his thing. The Most High is doing his thing. Yahweh Bashin, Yahweh Shai is doing his thing, man, out here, okay? Then you had that blackout in New York, which we all know, man, the elites is, the Most High is putting the spirit on these elites to start really making moves now and doing their thing, man. Okay, then you had the earthquake in California, and people are getting put to death left and right. Are you watching the news? All kind of judgments are being handed down upon people, man. People are getting hit, run over by cars. What's his name? Pernero Whitaker just got run over by a daggone car. Sweet Pete. So the Lord is bringing judgments upon people, man. The Lord is bringing heavy, serious judgments. A lot of people are getting put to death. And rightfully so, because a lot of you people now in this society are nothing but a bunch of demons, man. Here it is the other day. I'm looking on, what is it, uh, Facebook and shit. YouTube and Facebook. You got people going around, the black woman licking ice, going in the supermarkets. Now you got people going in supermarkets, okay? Taking ice cream out the goddamn freezer, all right? Licking the ice cream and putting it back in. You have one cracker working Taco Bell. He, uh, they got a picture of him licking the, 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 the taco shells, licking them. Then he had another, another video I saw up online. Some fat black bitch was in the supermarket. And, you know, the the, veg, the, the, the fresh produce area where all the vegetables and stuff are. She had a big, I mean, a big fucking precious looking black bitch. She jumped up and laid up in the vegetables. And she's pretty much rubbing and she's, she's rolling around in the vegetables. It's all right. She's rolling and rubbing herself with the vegetables, and she was saying some crazy shit. And then the supermarket, the, the, whoever the guy was, security, trying to get her out. Now, right there, the cops had a right to come and just gun her down, man. Shoot her fat black ass down. So you got you got nothing but a full, complete, reprobate spirit that's out here right now, man. A straight up reprobate, demonic, evil spirit. And the reason these things like this is going on, because like Job 924. I'm going to quote the scripture, Job 9.24. The reason that all this wickedness and iniquity is taking place is because the scripture says, the earth is given into the hands of the wicked. See, because everything that goes on, goes really, it goes back to Esau, the so-called white man, man. Because the white man is the devil, and the spiritual demon Satan works in league with him. So, uh, 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 when, 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 when you have a wicked, when you have a wicked person or wicked people ruling, of course the people in the society with those wicked people are ruling are going to be wicked people. Like our people, the Israelites, chick, you tribes. The reason y'all being wicked as hell and doing all this folly because Esau is ruling and Esau allows it. And Esau promotes that homosexuality, lesbianism. The so-called white man promotes it. So of course you niggas, man, uh, that's, the, that's the theme of America, do as thou will. But see, real soon, the Lord's going to come back and destroy this place. He's, he's pretty much here. We're just waiting for the major prophecies to take place of the, the chip being made mandatory, okay? Of the, uh, of the RFID chip being made mandatory, okay? The martial law. And pretty much, man, and then after that, the missiles, man. But I'm going to read a few scriptures because this is a wicked, evil place. This place, it kills your spirit. But that's why we got the comforter, which is the scriptures, which is Yahweh Shai, here to help. Uh, keep us uh, grounded, man. And that's what the scripture says. We gotta be, we gotta be uh, con continuously 
involved in pushing the word. It's continuously involved in prayer, man. Continuously meditating upon these scriptures and meditating upon uh, Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shra. Okay? Now, I'm going to read a couple of scriptures, man. Just in the book of Psalms, which is one of the most heaviest books in the Bible, man. The prayers. These are Psalms mostly written by King David. And they were prayers and also prophecies, man. So these are the type of things we got to get into, man. And we got to keep them prayers up. But I'm just going to read a couple of chapters. I'm going to read a couple of verses out of the book of Psalms, man. I'm going to start up with Psalms, the 94th chapter. And I'm going to hit the 11th verse first, right? Because this is, this is, this is heavy, man. Okay? Matter of fact, no. I'm, I'm going to start at uh, 13. Psalms 94, 13, all right? So it says right this, right? Psalms 94, 13, all right? Blessed is the man whom thou chasteneth. That's us. Starting with the elect of Israel, because we're catching all kind of hell, man. All kind of uh, demonic evil, wicked forces are coming against us. Our own so-called people are coming against us, and primarily this devil, the so-called white man, he's the main person that's coming against us because he knows that the, uh, the, this truth, this word we're bringing out, is, it means his end, okay, of all his wickedness. All right. Uh, th th uh, okay. Yeah. I'm going to start at uh, 12. I'm going to start at 12. Okay. Blessed is the man. Psalm 94 12. Blessed is the man whom thou chasteneth, right? And that's primarily talking about the men of the Lord, the prophets, the, the brothers of the elect that's pushing this word. O Lord Yahweh, and teaches him out of thy law, which is the scriptures. All right, we're being taught because the scriptures is the law of the Most High, right? Which we're supposed to keep the laws of the Lord and follow them, okay? That thou mayest give him rest from the days of adversity until the pit be digged for the wicked. That's right. What's the pit that's digged for the wicked? Destruction and slavery, okay? Those nuclear missiles, that's the that's the pit. And, and, and the Most High set it up where, and it says in the, I believe in Job, uh, he shall fall into the ditch which he made. So the Most High gave this devil, the so-called white man, the technology to build those nuclear missiles. So that's the pit. So the Most High said, okay, keeping us, the whole thing is uh, preserving his men until the, the wicked be put, in the, that, be put in that pit, okay? And the pit is the nuclear missiles. That's how he's going to be destroyed, man. Okay, the way of his destruction here in America. Okay. Now I'm going to jump down to... Um, jump down to the uh, 16th verse, right? This is Psalm 94, 16. Who will rise up for me against the evildoers? Okay, now who is that? The person that's going to rise up for us against the evildoers is Yahweh Shai, man. Okay, Yahweh Shai, Yahweh Bashim, Yahweh Shai. They're going to rise up for us against the evildoers. When, when Yahweh Shai comes back with those chariots and the angels, okay? Or who will stand up for me against the workers of iniquity? Okay? Who are the workers of iniquity? Esau, primarily, and the other nations. All this wickedness they're doing, man. The GMO foods, poison water, poison air, chemtrails, barium oxide, promoting all this wickedness, homosexuality, lesbianism, transgender. Right, 17th verse, Psalms 94, 17. Unless the Lord Yahweh Bashin Yahweh Shah had been my help, my soul had almost dwelt in silence. That's right, man. Man, we'd be destroyed, man. We'd be, we'd be just like everybody else. Okay? We wouldn't be hurt. We wouldn't be, we wouldn't be it. We wouldn't be here. We wouldn't be able to push this word out, man. So it's the spirit of the Lord that got us pushing this word out. The so-called white man, he's trying to uh, stop the word, but the word is going out. They mess with our pages on YouTube. They try to shut our channels down. They try to get us off the corners if they could, but then the spirit of the Lord got it where we're able to still do the work. So the only reason we're able to do this work is the Lord. To you devils, man. It's the spirit of the Most High Himself, who you call God, uh, of your house, that's actually, uh, the spirit is with us to keep pushing the word, man. Okay? All right? When I said, my foot stood, thy mercy, O Lord, Yahweh, help me up in the multitude of my thoughts within, uh, within me, thy comforts delight my soul. That's the scriptures. That's the comfort. Yahweh Shai, the scriptures, man. You know, when them spirits come against you, and if your spirit feels broken down, it's, it's Yahweh Shai, the word, the scriptures that help keep you going, that build you up, okay? Shall the throne of iniquity have fellowship with thee, 
which frameth mischief by law. That's right, man. That's Esau, the damn devil. Okay, it has nothing to do with them. This society, this wicked society, they pass wicked, evil laws. Okay, and it's mischief, like this uh, passing the homosexual law, passing the transgender law, passing laws now where young children can get sex changes, man. Passing these wicked, evil laws, man. Okay, that's mischief by the way. They use their law to promote wicked, mischievous, evil, uh, degenerate laws, man, which causes the people to act out in a degenerate manner. I'm going to read on, right? It's Psalm 94, 21. They gather themselves together against the soul of the righteous and condemn innocent blood. That's right, and that's what's happening. Because here it is that you have these scoffers and these other wicked people, they're coming against the men of the Lord that's out there pushing the word, man. Okay? That's trying to condemn or trying to uh, uh, make the Bible, or try, uh, trying to do away with the Bible. Okay? But the Lord Yahweh is my defense and my power. Is the rock of my refuge. That's right. And we know that the rock re represents Yahweh Shah himself. Okay, I'm going to read on. And he shall bring upon them their own iniquity. And shall cut them off in their own wickedness. Yea, the Lord Yahweh, our power, shall cut them off. That's right. How are they going to be cut off? By thermonuclear destruction. Okay? Which is what's coming. There's no way out of this for the so-called white man. And their own wickedness. Man, they created the missiles, but the missiles is a righteous thing. The Most High gave them the technology to build those missiles, man. Okay? I'm going to jump to the 13th verse. The Lord, the Lord is in Psalms 96, the 96th chapter. And I'm going to end it off with this, man. I just wanted to hit these points real quick. Before the Lord, Yahweh, our power. Before the Lord, Yahweh, our power. For he cometh, for he cometh to judge the earth. He shall judge the world with righteousness and the people with his truth. And that's right, the truth is coming. Man, the people are being judged with the truth. Meaning this word, man. This word is coming out and the judgments are coming out against these wicked ass evil people, man. They're being already condemned by the word of the Most High, man. Yahweh Bashi and Yahweh Shai, they're already being condemned. You understand what I'm saying? And that's what's going on now. Okay? But the ultimate is going to be the missiles. He cometh, he cometh. So the Lord is coming back. And you can see the presence of it in the earth. The prophecies are being fulfilled, man. All right? But with that, I'm going to wrap it up. I just wanted to throw this out there real quick. I'll be right to I'll come back later with some more videos, man. Shout out warm to all you brothers out there on the comment board. Yeah, I say, Barakatai, Yahweh, Shana, Yahweh, Shad. Shout out warm, Barakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakak